Hi guys, welcome back to our Gregory home. Today I'm going to be taking you to my local tractor supply. If you've never been to a tractor supply, it basically just has a bunch, a bunch of animal feed, animal products, but they also have a very cool spring selection, so I wanted to show that to you guys. So I'm going to start with this little section they have for dogs. There's this really cute signs. This one says love on it with a little paw print. Then they have some very cute um, collars and leashes, doggone happy. These hats were adorable. I wanted all of them. $14.99 for the hats. And this mug, I am going to go and pick up this white mug here, leader of the pack. Lucky dog, love that one. And doggy paddle, love those. There's some more dog signs, you, me, and the dog. Doggy paddle outfitters. And on the farm he had a dog. They had this really cute um, crate that said um, dog sweet dog on it. Some more signs, doggone happy bowls. I love this. Dogs welcome people tolerated. And then this bowl, strictly non vegetarian. Some more signs. These ones had little hooks on them. Happiness is a good dog. Today's agenda let dog in, let dog out, let dog in, let dog out, repeat. Some more leashes and collars. This one said hunting buddy on it, but that was pretty cute. They have these little dog food clip, do not leave food unattended, and then the other one says yappy campers. These little signs I thought were really adorable too. Warning our dog flunked out of obedience school. Do not leave food unattended in this house. And then they had no, solici no soliciting see dog for more details. Now I'm going on to the home decor area. They had these really cute boxes and these crates. I believe these were $19.99. Yep, there you go, $19.99. And then they had this really cute locally harvested honey box. It had this metal on the outside. I just thought that was so cute for 20 bucks. And then they had this metal olive bucket. This was like really cute with some blankets in it. And then you guys, they had this huge tobacco basket for only $35. I mean, this thing was ginormous. They had some cute chicken canisters for $12.99. And then next to that, they had some galvanized tins in the little galvanized basket, which I thought was really cute. And that was $17.99. Then they had some really cute planters. One was a faux wood. And then they had a bunch of other planners. So they had these two, dairy fresh milk, and then the butter, some more planners. This was a cool insect house. And then they had a bat shelter as well. Now you guys check out this window. Isn't it adorable? And then there's my kid, <laughs> $39.99 for this window. There was only one left. That's a really good price. I picked up one of these last year, they're little um, planter tins, and then this gardening tills the soil, tills the soul, sorry. This pig jar I thought was super cute, it was $20 for that, that would look so cute with some cotton stems in it. Then they had this little cow, let's see the price on this one was $12.99. And that little watering can was $19.99. These little plaques I thought were adorable. Raw Jersey milk. And these were $17.99, which I thought was pretty fairly priced. They had that one, and then they had another one on the other side, which I'll show you. Now, these little chicken birdhouses were adorable. Welcome to the coop. I have to go get some of these. $14.99 for that. They had this little pig, fresh quality farmer's market since 1960, $24.99. And then on the bottom, they had quality livestock poultry feed, and that was metal. And this one was $24.99 as well. Now here's that other plaque I showed you. Grandma's fruit pies, 
Now they had these rocking chairs guys for the front porch and they're only $150 which I thought was pretty reasonable. If you go to Home Depot they're going to be a little bit more pricey than that probably around $250. So here's Abby she wanted to rock in it she's my niece. Now they had these really cute pillows for $14.99. They kind of looked like burlap sacks but they weren't itchy if that makes sense. So this one looks like it's kind of sugar. This one looks like it's old fashioned cornmeal. And then they had white rock pancake flour. These would be so cute on those rocking chairs outside. Now here's another one that's a darker wood. I kind of like the white. Now moving on to the outdoor planters and gardening stuff. They had some planters. They had this really cute root viewer. Then they had some thermometers. They had some fun things that the kids could paint. They had some gnomes that the kids could paint, some bird houses. And then they had these really adorable gloves. They had Batman, Paw Patrol, Wonder Woman, just all kinds of really cute kid stuff. Now look at these cute shovels. And then they had these watering cans. All they had was Paw Patrol in that. So moving on to some planters. I thought this was adorable. Three tier harvest baskets. Now this was awesome. It was $100, which I thought actually was pretty reasonably priced, but it looks like it's an old trough and you can plant planters in it. And then they had this one that had a little stand. I thought this would be a really cute, um, like an outdoor sink. Then they had this one here. And this one actually you could buy a topper for it. I think the topper was $30. So you can turn it into kind of like a little greenhouse. Now here's another three-tiered tray. This would be really cute on a back patio. Now I thought these were so cute. You stick these in the ground and they're rain counters. So you can see how many inches of rain you get. Now here's some outdoor picks that you can hang um, hangable plants on. One had a chicken, one had a star on it, and then there's a hummingbird there. And then the taller ones were $24.99, and then the smaller ones were only $19.99. Now here's some of their amazing hummingbird feeders. They had so many cute ones to choose from. Most of them were $19.99. There's more of those on, on these were on the bottom shelf. And then one more row. Aren't those so pretty? Now these are little solar lights. These were so cute. They had a little tractor. And then you guys, they had the little red truck too. <laughs> Now here's a look at all of their new outdoor tools that you can use for gardening, for planting, if you have a farm. Now I wanted to show you a couple things they had on Clarence. They had this really cute tote. It says, Rule the Roost, and it has a rooster on the front. I thought that was really cute, and that was only $2. Then they had this burlap sack. It says, Do not open until December 25th, and you guys, this was only $3.29. And they had some toys left over, just a bunch of random things. Alright you guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe if you're new. I would love to have you join our Gregory home. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And remember to always be creative, be unique, and most importantly, be yourself. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye!